Season 10, Episode 89, Ling Dong advancing to the symbol Grandmaster level. A yellow sand cloud seemed to cover the sky as it descended, obscuring one sight. Lin Dong quietly stood within the yellow dust. His eyes penetrated through the sandy fog and focused on a certain spot. There was a sharpness, which had not appeared for a long time, in the eyes under his black hair. No unusual ripples emerged in the area after Lin Dong's voice sounded. However, his expression did not change. He continued to stare unwavering at that certain empty spot. Since a long time ago, he had vaguely felt that there was some other existence in this lonely purgatory during his training. However, that feeling was previously extremely obscure. With the rise in his mental energy cultivation, that feeling had finally become clearer. That hidden existence appeared to be quite frightening. However, Lin Dong also understood that he needed to defeat that hidden guardian in order to leave this place. Otherwise, he would have to stay in this place forever until even his body completely decomposed. The trials here are already useless against me. Therefore, you should personally take action. Lin Dong lifted his head while excitement surged within his black eyes. Buzz buzz. This time, there was finally some response from the empty space. One could see layers of ripples appearing within the emptiness as the sandy fog in the air actually gathered towards a certain empty spot. A long while later, one could see the yellow sand that seemingly filled the sky transform into an incomparably giant face. The face was extremely blurry, and it was not possible to clearly see it. However, Lin Dong felt the pores all over his body instantly tighten for some unknown reason because of this unfamiliar face. At this moment, he could feel a buzzing sound, which had disappeared for a long time, being emitted from his body. That undulation. It was the devouring ancestral symbol and the thunderbolt ancestral symbol. The two great ancestral symbols inside his body had actually started to stir. Although Lin Dong was unable to control the two great ancestral symbols because he was within purgatory, he was still able to detect even this faint activity from them as their current wielder. What a dangerous feeling. Lin Dong's expression was grave as he muttered. His eyes stared intently at the giant yellow sand face in the sky. He could swear that no one had ever given him such an indescribable feeling of terror. Even the darkness master in the devil suppressing prison could not compare. There is actually still someone who can build purgatory. That strange giant yellow sand face rippled while Lin Dong was feeling shocked in his heart. An ancient voice, which seemed to have existed since the beginning of the world, finally resounded across purgatory. The corners of Lin Dong's eyes twitched when heard this. The great shock in his heart caused him to involuntarily take a step back despite his current mental fortitude. After which, he slowly lifted his finger and pointed at the giant face as he spoke in a hoarse voice, You. You are the symbol ancestor? The only ones since the ancient era who could utter such words and cause him to feel a fear that surpassed even that of the darkness master could be counted with a single hand. Moreover, the greatest possibility was naturally the one who had stood at the peak of this world, the legendary symbol ancestor. Symbol ancestor? Ha ha, a name that I have not heard for a very long time. The giant yellow sand face rippled. Its sand eyes slowly shifted downwards and paused on Lin Dong. I am merely an imprint left behind when the symbol ancestor created purgatory. I will awaken as long as someone is able to construct purgatory. Of course, I am also the final guardian you have to beat in order to leave purgatory. As long as you are able to defeat me, you will be able to break out from purgatory. Beat you? Lin Dong's pupils contracted slightly. Although the thing before him was a mere imprint, it was still something that the person, who had once stood at the peak of this world, had left behind. Why? Are you afraid? I have witnessed your training in purgatory for over a decade. You do not appear to be someone who is easily frightened. The yellow sand rolled as the ancient voice once again sounded. Who? Lin Dong deeply inhaled as the shock within his eyes slowly receded little by little. Regardless of who the person in front of him was, he would likely never be able to escape purgatory if he was afraid. Elder, please teach me. Lin Dong cupped his fists together and shouted with a serious expression. Since the giant face before his eyes was the final guardian, the only way for Lin Dong to leave was to beat him. Let me experience the results of your training after all these years. The yellow sand on the giant face surged. Soon after, the land began to shake violently. The ground collapsed and bright red lava spluttered out like a sea. In the short span of a dozen breaths, the desert had turned into a land of lava. Lin Dong flew into the air. He frowned a little as he looked down at the lava sea below, which was emitting an astonishing heat. This giant face seemed to be able to draw upon the power at purgatory. Each simple gesture of it possessed extremely terrifying power. Bang! The lava sea surged and churned. 
soon after, lava pillars, which were tens of thousands of feet in size, suddenly shot out. They appeared like many giant bright red dragons. These huge dragons coiled and twisted in the sky while dark red light flashed on the lava that flowed on their bodies. Subsequently, the lava began to solidify, transforming their bodies into a crystal form that flickered with piercing light. The lava crystal dragons occupied the sky. Those bright red dragon eyes were locked onto Lin Dong. A terrifyingly high temperature was emitted from their bodies, causing even the surrounding space to show some signs of being distorted. Although these lava crystal dragons were still over tens of thousands of feet away, Lin Dong still felt that his entire body was burning hot as a searing pain spread across the surface of his body. These attacks were more difficult to deal with than the many trials that Lin Dong had experienced within Purgatory all these years. It seemed that it was not going to be easy to pass this last test. Roar! The lava crystal dragons coiled in the sky. In the next moment, they let out a long roar towards the heavens and their huge bodies turned into flashes of bright red light which charged towards Lin Dong from all directions. Lin Dong's expression was extremely grave as he gazed upon the 18 large lava dragons that were whistling over. Soon after, his right hand slowly closed as a silver white energy ripple quickly gathered within his palm. This was the mental energy that Lin Dong had obtained through this lengthy period of training. Scram! Lin Dong's eyes were cold as he threw a punch forward. Vast and mighty mental energy swept out like a flood at this moment, directly turning into a 10,000 feet large silver white mental energy palm. This huge palm was very different from one that was formed with Yuan power. It appeared almost completely real. This ability to give substance to mental energy was a path that one must take in order to advance to the symbol Grand Master level. At this level, one's mental energy was no longer as illusory and ethereal as before. It would no longer be weaker than Yuan power even in a head-on clash. Bang! The giant silver white palm ruthlessly smashed onto a lava crystal dragon as an astonishing strength directly caused the crystals on the huge lava crystal dragon's body to shatter. A mournful roar immediately sounded. Bang bang! Lin Dong was merciless in his attacks. A thought passed through his mind and the giant silver white palm transformed into many after images. They landed on the same spot on the lava crystal dragon's huge body in an extremely rapid and fierce manner. Lava spouted from that lava crystal dragon's body like a fountain. However, the lava dragon was no ordinary attack. Even though it had been injured by Lin Dong's powerful mental energy attack and its crystal body had been shattered, it did not fall apart. This fortitude caused Lin Dong's grave expression to deepen. Bang! Moreover, while a Lin Dong was busy fighting a lava crystal dragon, the other 17 had also come whistling towards him. Sharp and searing dragon claws tore through the sky. The frightening strength caused the space around Lin Dong to be completely shattered. Lin Dong watched the lava flow on the giant dragon claws that seemed to blot the sky as they rushed towards him and deeply inhaled a breath of air. In the next moment, the sharpness in those black eyes intensified. Buzz! Silver white mental energy directly spread from Lin Dong's body, forming a large silver white bell around him. Clang clang! The huge dragon claws ruthlessly smashed onto the large silver white bell. A clear and hurried chime resounded across the sky. In the face of the ferocious attacks of 17 lava crystal dragons, some cracks began to rapidly surface on the silver white bell, and it quickly shattered in the next instant. Swoosh! A silver white ray of light shot out the moment that silver white large bell was shattered. This ray of light was just like lightning. In a flash, it appeared above the seriously damaged lava crystal dragon's head. After which, its appearance was revealed. It was Lin Dong. However, Lin Dong's entire body was now wrapped in silver white armor while he held a silver white sharp long spear in his hand. An extremely formidable undulation rippled from the tip of the spear. Kill. A low and deep voice, which was filled with a desire to kill, was emitted from the silver white armor. The long spear in Lin Dong's hands instantly grew to a thousand feet. After which, the spear was swung and a puff sound appeared as it penetrated the head of the lava crystal dragon. Roar. A mournful roar sounded as the lava crystal dragon frantically struggled. Finally, it had no choice but to explode. A ray of light containing vast and mighty energy whizzed out from the explosion and tunneled into Lin Dong's body. Swoosh! As this strange ray of light entered Lin Dong's body, the surging mental energy around him instantly rose by 10%. I see. Lin Dong was startled as he felt the mental energy within his body suddenly rise. Soon after, he heartily laughed at the sky. In the next instant, his body shot out like a bolt of silver lightning. The silver spear in his hand was like a dragon as it clashed violently with the other 17 lava crystal dragons. Bang bang bang! 
sputtering lava filled the sky sky as a silver white figure continued to be sent flying. Cracks appeared on his armor. However, his battle lust remained akin to a tiger's. Each time his long spear pierced forward, it would penetrate a lava crystal dragon and another strange ray of light would subsequently rush into his body like the spoils of battle. The bitter fight in the sky continued for half a day. Lin Dong's body was very unsteady as his long spear, which was covered with cracks, was pulled out from the body of the last lava crystal dragon. Swoosh! The final ray of strange light surged into Lin Dong's body at this moment. He could feel the vast and endless undulations within his body. However, his face was covered with a tired expression. Although Lin Dong's mental energy rose rapidly each time he killed a lava crystal dragon, the energy he exhausted was also extremely great. There is still one more. Lin Dong slowly lifted his head and looked towards the strange giant yellow sand face in the sky. After which, his eyes gently shut as both of his hands slowly spread outwards. Dazzling silver white light emerged in wave-like fashion. Finally, it spread throughout the entire purgatory. Even if I fail, I will have died for a good cause. A mutter gently resounded within the place. After which, the silver light began to pull back. In the end, it turned into a seemingly real sky supporting pillar and shot towards the mysterious giant yellow sand face. Desperation flooded the land. Black hallucination fragrance, which was as viscous as ink, was flowing within the cave. Meanwhile, there was a figure sitting quietly on a stone platform, which was enveloped by dense layers of hallucination fragrance. The warm light around his body was faintly visible and it completely purified the demonic aura within the hallucination fragrance, that had invaded his body. Yan was standing beside the stone platform with his hands behind his back. Meanwhile, his eyes were focused on Lin Dong's body. Currently, there was a tinge of anxiety on his typically calm, emotionless face. It has been three months since Lin Dong entered purgatory. Yan knew that time flows differently in purgatory compared to the outside world. Three months here was perhaps decades in purgatory. Although what entered purgatory was merely Lin Dong's mental energy body, he still vividly lived through every second that went by in purgatory. His physical body had merely stayed here for three months. However, his mental energy body had already lived through decades. Moreover, no one had any means to find out how Lin Dong was doing in purgatory. This was something that even the current Yan couldn't detect. After all, he was merely able to borrow the strength of the eternal illusion demon flowers to build purgatory, but he did not have the ability to control it. Whether Lin Dong could break out of the cocoon would ultimately depend on his own abilities. Huh? Just as Yan sighed secretly in his heart, his eyes suddenly became focused. That was because he heard buzzing noises coming from within Lin Dong's body. It was from the two great ancestral symbols. Buzz buzz. Silver white mental energy surfaced from Lin Dong's body at this moment. His body, which had sat still for three months, trembled gently. Both his eyes were shut, but there was anxiety plastered all across his face. It seems like he was currently in a predicament. Mental energy seeping forth. Is he planning to break out of purgatory? When Yan saw this scene, he clenched his hands immediately. Since Lin Dong was able to reach this step, it indicated that he had came into contact with the final layer of purgatory. That was the most dangerous place and if he failed, he would be severely wounded. In fact, even his mental energy body would break down. Buzz. Silver white mental energy spread from within Lin Dong's body like floodwaters. Currently, the might of his mental energy far exceeded that of before. In fact, even the viscous hallucination fragrance surrounding him was blown backwards. At this moment, Lin Dong had clearly unleashed his mental energy to its limits. However, judging by his expression, it seems like he was in a pretty bad state. It looks like the guardian left behind by the symbol ancestor was indeed extremely terrifying. Mental energy continued to circle around Lin Dong for an hour or so, before they finally began to turn him in front of Yan's anxious eyes. Evidently, Lin Dong had exhausted his mental energy and he was beginning to fall into a disadvantage. Lin Dong, you must hang on. This is the final step. Yan clenched his hand and muttered to himself. Chi. However, things did not progress according to Yan's wishes. Instead, the brilliant silver white mental energy surging around Lin Dong's body turned him and began to retreat. Moreover, Yan knew that the moment Lin Dong's mental energy completely vanished, his mental energy body would also collapse. Yan had a tensed expression when he saw this scene. There was an unprecedented stern and solemn expression on his face. A long while later, he finally sighed bitterly. Was Lin Dong really going to fail? Buzz. After Yan sighed, the final trace of silver white mental energy turned dim before it vanished. Currently, the light surrounding Lin Dong's body had completely vanished. 
Instantly, it seemed as if Jan's face had aged rapidly as his eyes were filled with dark grayish despair. Eh? However, just as Jan's expression darkened, his mind was suddenly jolted. He felt bewildered as he stared at his own body. Since Lin Dong was the owner of the Ancestor Stone, once his mental energy body collapsed, Yan should disappear and return to the Ancestor Stone. However, why was he still standing here? Lin Dong is still alive? Yan's eyes were glimmering and his spirits were lifted immediately. Then, he lifted his head only to see that there were now two ancient symbols glimmering on the surface of Lin Dong's body. Those two symbols swiveled over his body, before they charged into the spot between his brows with a loud swoosh. A black lightning color gathered on Lin Dong's brows. After which, it began to rotate violently. Immediately, a small crack was directly ripped between Lin Dong's brows. Under that crack, was a mysterious eye filled with endless black light and lightning glow. That crack slowly opened up. Before that mysterious eye, which was glimmering with lightning glow and black light, slowly revealed itself. Bang! Immediately, an indescribable mental energy storm crazily erupted from within Lin Dong's body. After which, the black hallucination fragrance surrounding him was completely scattered. In fact, the entire cave began to tremble vigorously and even the mountain walls, which were constructed from unique materials, began to crack. Is that? The eye of the ancestral symbol? When Yan saw that mysterious eye between Lin Dong's brows, which was glimmering with lightning glow and black light, a tinge of shock flashed across his face. As the ancestor stone spirit, he naturally had a profound understanding of ancestral symbols. Thus, he knew that the eye of the ancestral symbol would only appear after the owner of the ancestral symbol forged an extremely close relationship with it. Since the beginning of time, only a few individuals managed to activate the eye of the ancestral symbol. Unexpectedly, Lin Dong was actually able to do so. Moreover, Lin Dong's eye of the ancestral symbol clearly possessed the strength of both the devouring ancestral symbol and the thunderbolt ancestral symbol. Therefore, it was undoubtedly a much more difficult feat to accomplish. The eye of the ancestral symbol merely appeared for a second, before it swiftly vanished. Finally, the crack disappeared before Lin Dong's brows returned to their original state. Bang! However, after the eye of the ancestral symbol disappeared, a resplendent silver-white light pillar suddenly shot out from within Lin Dong's body, before it penetrated the mountain wall above and broke free. Buzz! A 10,000 feet large silver-white light pillar broke out from the heavenly cave and shot towards the clouds. This strange scene immediately attracted the attention of every powerful celestial demon Marta tribe member. They were all stunned when they saw that silver white light pillar. Soon after, their expressions gradually turned grave. That was because they could sense a vast and mighty, ocean-like mental energy within. That mental energy could even strike fear in the hearts of powerful samsara stage experts. This mental energy. Someone has actually broken into the symbol grandmaster level? Truly amazing. His mental energy cultivation has actually reached that level. However, amongst the experts from our tribe who are currently undergoing a seclusion in the heavenly cave, it doesn't seem like there is anyone who possess such formidable mental energy. Standing beside the heavenly cave, several guards were stunned when they saw this scene. Subsequently, they voiced their doubts. It's Lin Dong. The tribe leader of the celestial demon Martin tribe slowly said. Currently, he was also stunned by this fact. Clearly. He did not expect that Lin Dong's mental energy cultivation would actually reach the symbol grandmaster level within merely three months. Truly impressive. First elder Julie, who was constantly standing guard here, involuntarily praised. Although he was a peak samsara stage expert who had touched reincarnation, his mental energy cultivation was far beneath Lin Dong's. In fact, he had also practiced mental energy before he ultimately gave up. That was because he knew just how difficult it was to reach the symbol grandmaster level. He has finally reached that level. Little Martin sighed somewhat emotionally. That ignorant youth, who first came into contact with mental energy at Qingyang Town, had finally entered the realm of master practitioners in this discipline. The silver white light pillar spread across the sky. Amidst that warm white light, Lin Dong's senses also began to spread. Although his physical body was still within the heavenly cave, his mental energy had became his sense of sight and touch, allowing him to absorb everything in this place into his sight. He was able to detect several powerful auras surging from various parts of the celestial demon Marta tribe. Meanwhile, there were also a couple of frightening auras located in some hidden spots. In fact, their auras were not inferior to that of first elder Julie. Huh? Lin Dong's heart suddenly jolted as his mental energy spread. Then, his eyes gathered towards the dark heavenly cave. That was because he could detect an extremely frightening aura from within. 
In fact, that aura was even more powerful than that of the celestial demon Marta tribe leader. Is that the person who has secluded himself at the deepest part of the heavenly cave? Silver white light spread before it seemingly agglomerated into a person. After which, the eye of the ancestral symbol slowly appeared between Lin Dong's brows. Immediately, to that eye, the darkness within the heavenly cave was non-existent. As if it had penetrated through space, that I stared right at the cave, which was located at the deepest part of the heavenly cave. In that cave, Lin Dong saw a withered figure who looked just like a skeleton. That figure had disheveled white hair which covered the entire cave. An exceptionally ancient scent was emitted from his body, giving a rustic scent to his surroundings. When Lin Dong peeked into that cave, that seemingly rotten withered figure suddenly opened his eyes, which seemed to have been shut for more than a thousand years. His eyes were filled with a unique bright silver luster. The eye of the ancestral symbol? His silver eyes looked at the empty space, before a tinge of shock flashed across them. Soon after, he glanced at the empty space quizzically before he waved his sleeves. After which, the empty space actually began to crack, before he directly stopped Lin Dong from peeping. In the distant sky, Lin Dong's body shook after his sight was cut off. He could detect a somewhat familiar ripple from that person, who had silver eyes. Clearly, he was an extremely powerful and unfathomable individual. One can only wonder where he came from. Is this the symbol Grand Master level? Lin Dong gradually recovered his senses. As he bathed in the unique sensation of being able to snoop on the entire world, he slowly spread his hands. At this moment, he felt as if he had merged with this part of the world. In fact, with just a single thought, he could unleash a frightening and destructive force in this part of the world. Lin Dong immersed himself in this wonderful sensation. In his absent-minded state, his mental energy began to drift into the horizon. Moments later, the empty space suddenly contorted, before a trace of metal energy penetrated through space and arrived at a foreign land. It was an ancient barren plains. At the end of this barren plains, stood a black palace. After which, one could see a black figure seated at the deepest part of that palace. That figure suddenly lifted his head. Black holes were rotating within his eyes and it looked like they had devoured the world. This scene came to a sudden stop. Lin Dong's mind regained its focus, before his heartbeat involuntarily increased. He knew. The barren plains and ancient palace that he just saw, was perhaps related to something that the nine tail fox had mentioned before. Devouring Divine Palace. That black figure should be. The Devouring Master. The vast and mighty mental energy, which pervaded the land, persisted for a while before it finally began to pull back like a receding tide. Within a short span of several breaths, the land regained its silence once more. In a certain cave within the heavenly cave, Lin Dong's eyes, which had been tightly shut for a long time, slowly opened. No light surged within those pitch black eyes. The only things within them was an abstruse night-like feeling and a blankness from not having adapted to his surroundings. The light within the quiet cave appeared rather gentle while the fresh smell of soil penetrated the smooth cave walls. Such tranquility made one subconsciously relax. However, this tranquil atmosphere felt extremely foreign as he stared at it. Although his appearance had not changed, the expression surging within his eyes made it seem as if he had been cut off from this world. Only three months had passed in the outside world. However, Lin Dong had spent over a decade within the lonely purgatory. This was not a short period of time. During these 10 years, he had not rested as he was constantly struggling within the cruel purgatory. Yan stood by the side and quietly watched Lin Dong, whose blank gaze contained feelings of unfamiliarity. He did not speak out to the latter. This was normal. However, he believed that Lin Dong would be able to very quickly recover and regain his memory from before he entered purgatory. Candlelight swayed within the quiet cave. Lin Dong silently sat on the stone platform for the greater part of the day. Finally, he deeply inhaled a breath of air as his face began to regain the expression that Yan was familiar with. How much time has passed outside? Lin Dong lifted his head and smiled as he looked at Yan and asked. Only three months. Yan replied. Only three months huh? Lin Dong's expression was complicated as he sighed. Who could have imagined that these peaceful three months in the outside world would be so long and cruel in his eyes? However, you have benefited a lot. Yan smilingly said as his eyes paused on Lin Dong. He very clearly felt the vast and mighty mental energy that had surged out from the latter's body earlier. Lin Dong had indeed stepped into the symbol Grand Master level. I have worked hard for so many years. It will be far too embarrassing if I fail to advance. Lin Dong stretched his waist. After which, he leapt down from the stone platform. 
Slightly shutting his eyes, he felt the majestic and endless mental energy in his now one place and said, Currently, I can only be considered to be an initial symbol grandmaster. Once you step into the advanced symbol grandmaster level, even those experts who have touched the reincarnation power will not be a match for you. That won't be easy. Lin Dong faintly smiled. After his mental energy had reached this level, the amount of effort and hardship needed to advance was tremendous. This time, he had borrowed the power of the Eternal Illusion Demon Flowers in order to reach the initial symbol Grandmaster level in three short months. From a certain point of view, it had not been easy to endure through these three months. Lin Dong was uncertain of just how many times he had escaped from the jaws of death during this period of time. These things are already useless. Shall we get rid of them? Lin Dong glanced at the Eternal Illusion Demon Flowers within the cave. Presently, these Demon Flowers were all in states of withering. It was clear that their power had been completely exhausted. However, these Demon Flowers were rather bizarre. Since he no longer had any use for them, it was best to eliminate them. I. Yan did not have any objections to this. Since Lin Dong had already achieved his aim, these things were useless. Lin Dong chuckled upon seeing this. He did not make any movements. But those eternal illusion demon flowers in the cave suddenly turned into dust that drifted downwards. Let's go, it's time to leave. Lin Dong stretched his waist again. He did not give the place another glance and directly walked out of the cave. Behind him, Yan nodded and turned into a flash of light which shot into Lin Dong's body. Lin Dong's footsteps paused as he walked out of the heavenly cave. He slightly tilted his body and looked towards the deepest part of the heavenly cave. When his mental energy had broken through to the symbol grandmaster level earlier. He had used the ancestral symbol I to see the figure in the deepest part of the heavenly cave. He was unable to detect an overly frightening aura from the silver-eyed figure, but his sharp senses told him that this person's strength was likely also at an extremely terrifying level. So terrifying that Lin Dong would not have even the slightest chance of victory if he was to fight against this person in his current state. I wonder just which old demon it is who has survived since those ancient times. Lin Dong seemed to mutter to himself. After which, he turned around, following the dark tunnel as he slowly exited the heavenly cave. It was a long while later before he walked out of the dark tunnel. Warm sunlight finally began to sprinkle down from the sky. As Lin Dong took a step forward, a quiet mountain range, which was accompanied by a majestic aura, entered into his sight. The peacefulness before his eyes caused Lin Dong to be a little mesmerized. He had never enjoyed such peace during the decade that he had spent in purgatory. You have finally come out. A familiar yet seemingly distant voice was suddenly transmitted into Lin Dong's ear. After which, he saw a figure appeared beside him as a bewitchingly handsome face appeared before his eyes. Little. Little Martin. Lin Dong was slightly startled as he looked at that extremely familiar face. Soon after, his lips parted into a smile. After which, he extended his arms and forcefully hugged the latter. The loneliness within the purgatory had been torture. Hence, he felt deeply emotional upon seeing these familiar faces. TSK, TSK, what are you doing? Little Martin was shocked by this sudden action of Lin Dong. However, his heart was a little moved by the emotions he felt from Lin Dong's hug. They had met when they were both extremely weak and helpless, and protected each other all the way here. This bond surpassed even that shared by brothers. Lin Dong quickly released his embrace. The smile on his face had also become a lot more natural. Clearly, he was gradually recovering from his memories of purgatory. Are you alright? Little Martin looked at Lin Dong strangely and involuntarily asked. Little Martin finally began to properly observe Lin Dong at this moment. Although it had been only three months since he had last seen the latter and the latter's appearance had not changed, he was still able to rely on his familiarity with Lin Dong to sense some differences from those pitch black eyes. The current Lin Dong seemed to have suddenly become a lot older and unfathomable. This feeling was as though Lin Dong had been in seclusion within the heavenly cave for 30 years instead of just three months. It's nothing. Lin Dong chuckled and said. He gently patted Little Martin's shoulder. This appearance caused the latter to feel confused. Haha, ha, young friend Lin Dong, congratulations on advancing to the symbol Grandmaster level. Even within the Celestial Demon Martin tribe, only a handful have managed to attain such mental energy accomplishments. The Heavenly Demon Martin tribe leader also walked forward. His expression contained some surprise as his eyes swept over Lin Dong. Their tribe did possess some elders with astonishing mental energy cultivation. However, all of them had accumulated their strength over long periods of time. It was extremely rare to find a young symbol grandmaster like Lin Dong. This junior is merely lucky. Lin Dong shook his head. 
If it was not because he had used the eternal illusion demon flowers to build the mysterious purgatory, it would likely require a couple of years in order to cross this. Frightening gully even with Yan's help. If one can rely on luck to break through to the symbol grandmaster level, there will not be so few symbol grandmasters in this world. The tribe leader of the celestial demon Marta tribe laughed. Ha ha, it is likely that young friend Lin Dong is a little tired after returning from your seclusion. I believe that we should first let him rest for one or two days. First Elder Jun Li laughed from the side. The leader of the celestial demon Martin tribe nodded. He spoke a little more to Lin Dong before leading his people away. All of them had been standing guard here while Lin Dong was in seclusion. I will first bring you to rest. You seem to be a little out of sorts. Little Martin said. Lin Dong nodded. He did indeed need some time in order to completely free himself from the memories of purgatory and return to his usual self. Lin Dong remained within the Celestial Demon Marta tribe during the next two days, and finally made a full recovery after these two days of recuperation. The cruel training within the purgatory had already been deeply buried in his mind. However, the vast and mighty mental energy Lin Dong had obtained still pervaded his Naiwan palace, letting him understand that the bitter training within purgatory was not without reward. Lin Dong sat on the edge of a cliff belonging to a lush green mountain. His eyes looked at the sea of trees below as he suddenly stretched. After which, he spoke in his mind, my mental energy had crossed the borders of space the day I exited my retreat and I saw the devouring divine palace. Oh? Yan cried out in a startled voice upon hearing this. Clearly, he did not expect Lin Dong to detect the existence of the devouring divine palace. The devouring divine palace seems to be hidden in another pocket dimension. It is impossible to detect its actual location. However, I am able to sense an increasingly violent and out of control energy from that pocket dimension. Therefore, it is likely that the pocket dimension where the devouring divine palace is hidden will emerge within a month. One month huh? So soon? Aye. There will likely be quite a big commotion when that time comes. It is likely that the experts in the entire demon region will be able to detect it. Lin Dong slightly narrowed his eyes. The devouring divine palace's appearance would definitely stir a huge commotion the moment it appeared. Given the reputation of the Devouring Master during those ancient times, it was likely that all factions will greatly covert it. Moreover, not everyone knew that the Devouring Ancestral symbol was in Lin Dong's hands. Therefore, it was likely that even the four overlord tribes would have difficulty remaining calm when the Devouring Divine Palace appeared. Although Lin Dong need not be worried about the Dragon Tribe and the Celestial Demon Marta Tribe given his relation with them, there were still the other two equally powerful overlord tribes watching from the side. Most importantly, that omnipresent devil prison would likely also get involved when they learned of this matter. At that time, it would not be easy for Lin Dong to obtain the inheritance of the Devouring Master in front of all those outstanding experts. However, Lin Dong smiled. There was a formidable look rising from the corners of his lips. I will not yield the inheritance of the Devouring Master to any of you. After resting for another two days in the Celestial Demon Marta tribe, Lin Dong decided to leave. As of now, the problem within the Celestial Demon Marta tribe had already been resolved. In fact, everything became orderly the moment the tribe leader left his seclusion. Furthermore, after what Hao Jiayu did, all the elders who were previously on his side were rather anxious because they were afraid of being made to take responsibility. Hence, when the time came to select the tribe leader's successor again, they immediately sided with Little Martin in an attempt to right their wrongs. Therefore, Little Martin easily became the next tribe leader successor. These matters were considered the internal affairs of the Celestial Demon Martin tribe. Therefore, Lin Dong did not interfere. In fact, he was prepared to leave after saying his goodbyes to the tribe leader. However, before he could leave, Little Martin decided to tag along as well. According to him, since his father was around, the current Celestial Demon Martin tribe had nothing to worry about. Therefore, he had nothing to do if he stayed behind and it was better for him to follow Lin Dong to the Beast War region instead. After some deliberation, Lin Dong did not reject this fellow, who insisted on following him. In any case, the Devouring Divine Palace would appear in about a month and it would definitely cause a huge commotion. With Little Martin by his side, his lineup would become a little grander. It was three days later before the Lin Dong duo finally returned to Deep Lightning Mountain. However, when they first arrived at the sky above Deep Lightning Mountain, they were shocked by the liveliness and vitality of this boundless mountain range. Amidst the mountain range stood various halls and palaces. Meanwhile, a huge defensive light barrier rose around the mountain range, protecting the entire mountain range. Even though this defensive formation was far inferior to the tribe guarding formation of the Celestial Demon Martin tribe, it was much better compared to the previous one. 
Moreover, groups of armored troops patrolled the sky, while the numerous densely packed figures in the many squares below looked as if they were training. Their low roars, which contained a potent murderous aura, gathered together before they spread into the distance, causing the air to vibrate. PSK DSK, pretty impressive. When Little Martin saw the scale of the current Deep Lightning Mountain, shock surfaced in his eyes as he laughed. He had came to Deep Lightning Mountain before. However, compared to before, the difference was like day and night. Lin Dong nodded. After his mental energy advanced to the symbol Grandmaster level, he no longer had to specifically scan the area. He immediately detected the many powerful auras present within this mountain range. Moreover, he was stunned when he realized that five of them had actually reached the Samsara stage. There are two additional unknown Samsara stage experts. Lin Dong's brow raised a little. According to his memory, the entire Four Titans Palace only had three Samsara stage experts, the Heaven Dragon Demon Commander Trio. Moreover, even Little Flame had to rely on his Tiger Devouring Army in order to reach that level. Where did these two unknown Samsara stage experts come from? Don't tell me that there are actually ultimate Samsara stage experts that came over to join our Four Titans Palace? Curiosity was piqued in Lin Dong's heart. An expert at that level could go to any place in the Demon region and establish a faction. Yet, they actually came to join a relatively unknown Four Titans Palace? This was indeed a little interesting. Let's go. Lin Dong smiled at Little Martin. After which, he took the lead and rushed towards Four Titans Palace. Along the way, their entry was detected by the patrol teams. Immediately, dozens of powerful auras surrounded them. However, the instant they saw Lin Dong, their cautious expressions turned to respect. Lin Dong waved his hands towards the powerful individuals from Four Titans Palace who were about to bow and greet him. After which, they realized that their bodies had suddenly froze, and even the surging Yuan power within their bodies seemed to have left their control. This. Those powerful individuals exchanged glances with each other and saw the shock in each other's eyes. This was especially the case for the two leaders. Both of them were at the advanced profound death stage. Even though they were not considered part of the elite, they were quite powerful and it was no easy task for a Samsara stage expert to restrain them. However, to be even able to cause them to lose control over the Yuan power in their bodies. In a short three months, Chief Lin Dong has become even more powerful and unfathomable. Where is Commander Yan? Lin Dong's gaze swept around and asked. Commander Yan is currently at the fighting arena on the main mountain. The Heaven Dragon Demon Commander and the other leaders are also there. Today is an important day. Lord Zhou Yi and Lord Zhou Li have come to join our Four Titans Palace. The leader of the patrol respectfully replied. Zhou Yi? Zhou Li? Lin Dong lifted his brow. They are top experts who once dominated the Western Sand region. However, the Western Sand region was invaded by Mong Mountain not long ago and the faction under them collapsed. Right now, they wish to join our Four Titans Palace to seek refuge. After all, over all these years, our Four Titans Palace is the only faction that has survived after opposing Mong Mountain. So they have offended the Nine Phoenix tribe. Lin Dong smiled faintly. Oh well. In any case, he did not have a good impression of the Nine Phoenix tribe. Therefore, he would not treat the Zhou Yi duo shabbily if they were sincere about joining Four Titans Palace. The leader of the patrol glanced at the main mountain, before he suddenly dismissed his subordinates. Then, he softly whispered, Chief Lin Dong, although the Zhou Yi duo came to seek refuge, it is rumored that they are quite arrogant. In fact, they even suggested that they should be given the same position as the five great leaders of Four Titans Palace. Lin Dong's eyes hardened upon hearing this. After which, a grin surfaced from the corners of his lips. Were they trying to seek refuge or conduct a coup? The reason why the Heaven Dragon Demon Commander Trio were given positions as one of the five great leaders was because they had made contributions. However, these two, who appeared out of nowhere, actually wanted to have a similar position. TSK, two homeless strays actually dare to issue such demands? They truly don't know their limits. Lin Dong had yet to express his opinion when Little Martin, who was standing beside him, coldly chuckled. The leader of this patrol was a veteran in Deep Lightning Mountain and he had met Little Martin before. Hence, he naturally knew the latter's status. Immediately, he laughed, Master Martin is right. Commander Yan did not agree to their request as well. He merely used a delaying tactic and said that he will give an answer only after Chief Lin Dong returns. Lin Dong nodded. Two ultimate Samsara stage experts were considered a huge gift. If they were absorbed, it would significantly boost the power of their Four Titans Palace. That was most likely why Little Flame did not immediately send them packing. 
Since they dare to make such outrageous demands, let's go and find out how powerful those two fellows, who were forced to flee by the Nine Phoenix tribe, are. Lin Dong smiled. He turned to look at that burly looking patrol leader before he asked, That's right, what is your name? This subordinate is called Hoi Yuan. I have been Commander Yan's subordinate since back when he was still General Yan of Deep Lightning Mountain. The leader of the patrol rejoiced upon hearing this as he hurriedly replied, Hoi Yuan. Hmm, well done. Lead the way. Lin Dong laughed. This was someone that he could use in future. Understood. Hoi Yuan had an excited expression. He understood Four Titans Palace very well. Although it claimed to have five great leaders, most of the matters were decided by Commander Yan and the Heaven Dragon Trio. However, if they failed to come to an agreement, the one who had the final say was Chief Lin Dong. Hence, strictly speaking, Lin Dong held the highest position amongst the five of them. However, this was something that most outsiders did not know. Now that he was able to make a good impression on this true hidden leader, he knew that he would definitely have a bright future in Four Titans Palace as long as he remained loyal. The Fighting Arena on the main mountain of Four Titans Palace. This fighting arena was extremely spacious. Currently, the arena was packed and appeared exceptionally lively. Not only were the many members of the upper echelons of Four Titans Palace present, but even Little Flame and the three other leaders had showed up. As such, it was an exceptionally grand scene. Over a hundred figures stood below the stone steps of the main arena. However, they appeared extremely relaxed and most of them were smiling mischievously. This was in sharp contrast to the stern-looking fully armored members of Four Titans Palace. Some of the more powerful individuals from Four Titans Palace frowned slightly upon seeing this. Following the complete reorganization of Four Titans Palace, it was no longer as disorderly as before. Their strict rules also allowed their Four Titans Palace to turn into a massive organization that one could not underestimate. Hence, they felt a little unhappy with this outlaw-like group. Although they felt displeased, none of them showed it. All they did was cast their attention towards the four figures on the stage. Amongst the four of them, Little Flame was considered the leader. Although he was merely at the perfect profound death stage, the Heaven Dragon Demon Commander and the rest knew that Little Flame would not lose to them in a fight. This, along with his relationship with Lin Dong, made them extremely polite towards Little Flame. Little Flame indifferently glanced at the group in front of him. After which, he turned his attention towards the front of the group where two figures were lazily standing. Although they were behaving more appropriately than the subordinates behind them, there was still a trace of haughtiness on their faces. This is my Four Titans Palace. If you do not behave yourselves, perhaps I will have to ask my Tiger Devouring Army to issue you a warning. Little Flame's tiger eyes surveyed the entire place before he spoke in a faint voice. Roar. Little Flame's voice had only just sounded, when the over thousand members strong tiger devouring army standing guard here released a low roar. Moreover, their roar seemed to come from a single body. Immediately, a black aura surged and directly transformed into a ferocious black tiger. Its brutal aura dashed through the clouds. The expressions of the hundred men group changed when they saw this scene. After which, their expressions became a little unnatural. Though they were rather powerful, they knew that they were just like a mob when compared to this orderly tiger devouring army. Ha! Commander Yan, please do not be angry. My subordinates are too used to acting as they please and they still do not know how to behave themselves now that they are in a different place. It'll be better in future. A grey clothed middle aged man standing in front laughed. Brother Joe Yi, I do not care about how you people behaved in the past. However, now that you wish to join our Four Titans Palace, you will have to obey our rules. The Heaven Dragon Demon Commander laughed as he said. Brother Heaven Dragon is right. The other person standing beside Zhou Yi also smiled and nodded. After which, he looked at Little Flame and crossed both of his arms together as he slowly said, However, Commander Yan, regarding our request, may I know what your decision is? We are famous and reputable men in the Western Sand region. Now that we sincerely hope to join your Four Titans Palace, it shouldn't be overboard to give us a leader position, am I right? Little Flame frowned. Meanwhile, a look of hesitation flashed across the eyes of the Heaven Dragon Demon Commander Trio. Ha! Commander Yan. Judging by your actions, it seems like you are looking down on us brothers? Zhou Yi smiled faintly upon seeing this. In that case, I think we should forget about it. This place is far too big. Perhaps us brothers should not stay any longer. Zhou Li revealed a mocking smile before he waved his hand and proceeded to leave with his men. Ha! From the way I see it, it is not my Four Titans Palace looking down on the both of you. Rather, it seems like the both of you are looking down on my Four Titans Palace. 
What do you take my four titans palace as? A place you can choose to come and go as you please? However, a faint laughter suddenly descended from the sky after Zhou Li's body moved. After which, countless pairs of eyes looked upwards and saw the Lin Dong duo. Lin Dong was hovering in the sky. His eyes contained a playful glint as he stared at the Zhou Yi duo. Meanwhile, an iciness radiated from the smile on his lips. According to our rules, what should we do to anyone who dares to looks down on our Four Titans Palace? Kill. Every expert from Four Titans Palace standing on the fighting arena cried out in a frosty and orderly voice as their eyes suddenly became ice cold. Their icy voices were accompanied by astonishing murderous desire as they reverberated across the sky. The Zhou Yi duo's expressions finally changed after they felt this killing intent. Killing intent shrouded the sky, and it felt as if the temperature had drastically fallen. Fear was revealed on the faces of the previously merrily laughing group, while the smiles on their faces had finally disappeared. Originally, they had thought that with the two leaders bringing them to join Four Titans Palace, the latter would definitely lower themselves and try to welcome them. Yet, the scene before them now. It seemed that Four Titans Palace did not feel that they must absolutely have the Zhou Yi duo join them like the latter had imagined. The Zhou Yi duo were also startled because of this sudden turn of events. Soon after, they lifted their heads to look at the two unfamiliar figures in the air and frowned slightly. Clearly, they did not know the identities of these two. Big Brother. However, just as fury was rising in their hearts, Little Flame's joyous voice stunned them. Their eyes flashed, and only then did they look at this young skinny figure with surprise. Other than that rarely seen Lin Dong, there was no one else Commander Yan of Four Titans Palace would call Big Brother. In the air, Lin Dong smiled at Little Flame. After which, he landed on the ground. Ha ha, brother Lin Dong, you have finally returned. The Heaven Dragon Demon Commander Trio grinned and said after seeing Lin Dong. Their eyes involuntarily paused on the latter when they spoke. Although it had only been three months since they last met, they could feel that Lin Dong was very different from before for an inexplicable reason. Although Lin Dong's fighting strength was already extremely overwhelming previously, his cultivation was merely that of the advanced profound death stage. Unless he was in his battle mode, the Heaven Dragon Demon Commander Trio would not detect any pressure from him. After all, they were genuine Samsara stage experts. Lin Dong was able to rely on his many techniques to raise his fighting strength, but a gap still existed between them. Now however, the vast and mighty ocean-like Yuan power within their bodies had become a little sluggish for some unknown reason when they looked at Lin Dong. This was due to a certain kind of pressure. Moreover, it was very obvious that this pressure originated from Lin Dong. The three of them secretly exchanged glances. They could see the astonishment within each other's eyes. Big Brother. Little Flame walked over and glanced at the Zhou Yi duo. Yes, I am already aware of the situation. Lin Dong nodded. Soon after, he faintly laughed. Samsara stage experts are indeed a great help. But if they aren't suitable, it will instead cause the faction that we have built with great effort to be jeopardized. From the looks of it, the Zhou Yi duo were clearly extremely proud individuals. Such people might be strong, but if no one suppressed them, they would only cause internal chaos within Four Titans Palace. At that time, this huge organization that they had created with much difficulty would end up collapsing. Lin Dong was also well aware that he must not give in when faced with such arrogant individuals. Otherwise, they would only take advantage and it will be even more difficult to suppress them in future. Little Flame nodded. He also understood this point. However, the Zhou Yi duo were indeed powerful. Within Four Titans Palace, even the Heaven Dragon Demon Commander Trio would have difficulty obtaining a clear victory in a one-on-one -on -one fight. It was precisely because of this that trying to forcefully suppress the pride of these two was not an easy task. Leave this to me. Lin Dong smiled as an indescribable expression flashed across his eyes. Amongst the five great leaders in the newly established Four Titans Palace, the individual strengths of both Little Flame and himself did not stand out. The reason he could suppress the Samsara Stage Heaven Dragon Demon Commander Trio, was mainly because he possessed the identity of the Dragon Tribe Punishment Elder and his shocking battle power. Although the Heaven Dragon Demon Commander Trio appeared quite respectful, it was unavoidable that they would feel some unease deep within their hearts. The Demonic Beast World Honored Strength. Lin Dong's advanced profound death stage strength would ultimately cause them to feel some discomfort in their hearts. Lin Dong had been well aware of this in the past. However, due to his strength having yet to reach the necessary level, he did not make any moves. Things were different now. With the advancement of his mental energy to the symbol Grand Master level, just his mental energy cultivation alone meant that ordinary Samsara stage experts would no longer be a match for him. 
This was the best time to create a deterrence to those outside and within the faction. Haha, ha, this must be Brother Lindong, right? We have long heard of your name. The complexions of the Zhou Yi duo gradually recovered. They looked at Lin Dong, cupped their hands together and smilingly said. Those who come are guests. Please forgive us if there is any way we have failed to take care of you. However, you should seek to understand the rules of my four titans palace. Lin Dong faintly smiled and said. That is only natural. Zhou Yi nodded. His gaze quickly shifted as he said, but we also hope brother Lin Dong can understand our difficulties. We have brought our subordinates here. If we fail to gain some kind of position, we will neither have the face to see them nor be able to account to them. Why is someone who has been chased away by the Nine Phoenix tribe speaking about face? Isn't that a little comical? Little Martin coldly laughed. His laughter was filled with ridicule. What did you say? The expressions of the Zhou Yi duo instantly changed upon hearing these words as they furiously roared. Are you deaf? Can't you hear what Grandpa Martin has said? Little Martin's eyes suddenly became ice cold. He took a step forward as a monstrously baleful or directly spread over the entire place. Do you think that you are qualified to shout in front of Grandpa Martin? The Nine Phoenix tribe was able to force you to flee. Don't tell me that my Celestial Demon Martin tribe still needs to be courteous to the both of you? Celestial Demon Martin tribe? The expressions of Zhou Yi Duo stiffened almost immediately while the rage in their eyes froze. They were a little stunned as they looked at the bewitchingly handsome face of Little Martin, who wore the mocking smile of someone looking down on them. The words that were about to emerge from the Zhou Yi Duo's mouth were forcibly swallowed by them. They did not expect that this person in front of them was actually from the Celestial Demon Martin tribe. Haha, ha, please do not mind him. My second brother always has such a temper. He is the tribe leader successor of the Celestial Demon Martin tribe. Therefore, his character is a little bad. Lin Dong smiled warmly. However, the words he said did not match his expression. Nevertheless, it was likely that the Zhou Yi duo understood his meaning. Tribe leader successor? The corners of Zhou Yi's eyes twitched rapidly. He felt greatly shocked in his hearts. Both of them had been forced into such a miserable state after merely offending an elder within the Nine Phoenix tribe. This person in front of them was actually the tribe leader successor of the Celestial Demon Martin tribe? This position was many times higher than that of an elder. If they were to offend him, it was likely that they could forget about staying in this demon region. This Four Titans Palace actually has such a relationship with the Celestial Demon Martin tribe? Zhou Yi's heart pounded. The arrogance originally present on his face had greatly diminished. Those subordinates behind him also shuddered. Regardless of how stupid one was, one could still clearly see that something was not quite right with this situation. With the backing of the Celestial Demon Martin tribe, Four Titans Palace did not need to hold their pathetic group in high regard. Brother Zhou Yi, we are aware that you have offended the Nine Phoenix tribe. Now, the other party has said that they wish to deal with you. However, as long as you join Four Titans Palace, the Nine Phoenix tribe will not dare to act as they please. Brother Lin Dong is also the punishment elder of the Dragon Tribe, a position personally appointed by the tribe leader. Behind our Four Titans Palace are two overlord tribes, the Dragon Tribe and the Celestial Demon Martin Tribe. What would the Nine Phoenix Tribe dare to do? The Heaven Dragon Demon Commander also laughed at this moment. Celestial Demon Martin Tribe. Dragon Tribe. The Zhou Yi duo faced each other. Their mouths were rather dry. Two of the four strongest overlord tribes in the demonic beast world were actually backing Four Titans Palace. No one but the Nine Phoenix tribe did not dare to cause much trouble when Mong Mountain ended up withdrawing in a defeated manner after attacking the Beast War region. I am aware that you have some grudges with a certain elder of the Nine Phoenix tribe. I cannot guarantee anything, but I can tell you that my Four Titans Palace might be one of your very limited choices in order to find an opportunity to take revenge and avoid being taken revenge on by the Nine Phoenix tribe. Lin Dong smiled faintly. He stared at the Zhou Yi duo, whose expressions were fluctuating, as he continued, Of course, if you people do not feel any enmity towards those who have uprooted the faction that you established with much effort and chased you away like homeless strays, you can treat it as though I have not said anything. The expressions of the Zhou Yi duo had become completely dark after Lin Dong's words sounded. There was a dense hatred surging within their eyes. They were top experts in the Western Sand region. Yet, their reputation was completely ruined this time around. Fleeing all over the place and trying to seek protection was really something that the both of them could not bear. Such an enmity was extremely great. How can we forget? Us brothers will definitely turn that old dog into mincemeat within our lifetime. Zhou Yi gnashed his teeth and said. Brother Lin Dong, I am aware of the meaning behind your words. We have been too arrogant in Four Titans Palace earlier. 
I hope that brother Lin Dong can be magnanimous and forgive our offense. Zhou Yi cupped his hands together, faced Lin Dong and said. At this moment, they had finally began to understand that they had no choice but to join Four Titans Palace if they wished to seek revenge. Four Titans Palace has strict rules. If you wish to join, you will be members of Four Titans Palace in future. You should be able to guess the outcome of not following the rules. Lin Dong's sharp eyes stared at Zhou Yi's group as he slowly said. The Zhou Yi duo exchanged a look. They subsequently clenched their teeth and nodded. Now, do you wish to obtain a leader position in Four Titans Palace? Lin Dong crossed his fingers and laughed faintly after seeing that the pride of these two had been suppressed. Brother Lin Dong really knows how to joke. We are already extremely grateful that you have accepted us. We do not dare to make such an over-the-top request. Zhou Yi laughed bitterly. Although he hid a sliver of dissatisfaction in his heart, his group was currently unqualified to display it at such a time. Four Titans Palace could do without them, but they could not do without the protection of Four Titans Palace if they wished to seek revenge. I can give the both of you a chance if you wish to have a leader position in Four Titans Palace. Whether you can grasp this opportunity will depend on your ability. Lin Dong smiled faintly as he looked at the two people below. What kind of chance? The Zhou Yi duo lifted their heads. Their eyes were searing hot as they stared at Lin Dong. Lin Dong slowly extended his hand. After which, he slowly beckoned under the stunned expressions of the Heaven Dragon Demon Commander and the rest. Attack together and defeat me. The entire place fell into an uproar, 